Asian karate is a, is a Japanese martial art, but it's only a, one part of a karate discipline. So Kyokushin karate is more like a bare knuckle fight, and um, we we are allowed to hit, we are allowed to punch and knee and elbow and kick, but we don't wear guards. Okay, but we don't, we're not allowed to punch in the face okay, with bare knuckle. And some karates they do punch in the face. They do allow headshots, but they wear gloves. So Kyokushin, that's that's all, that's the, that's really everything about Kyokushin karate. We fight bare knuckle, but we don't punch the face. <laughs> Moa. I've been training with him for about two and a half years now, and uh, Mo's fighting style has changed since he came my dojo and since he started training with me. He has his own style, which is very good. And uh, I do respect his style. But the, the reason I try to change his style is he's a very strong man, physically and mentally. And he got good skills, stamina, speed. He got everything. But the problem is, he's too big-headed. So anyone he meets, he fights like a pit bull. And in a Kyokushin Karate fight, you have to use your head, okay? He got big heart, he got a lot of respect from me. Yeah, I respect his heart. But he needs a little bit more than that to win the tournament, to be the first place. But imagine he fights someone 6'2", 300 pounds. There are many Kyokushin fighters out there like that. Big guys, yeah? Iranian guys, Russian guys, yeah? Some American guys. And Mo will... Uh, will have very small chance winning them because he'll just go bang but those guys will just love it I want Mo to fight more like a fight like a pit bull when he needs to, but a lot of times he has to be more agile. He has to think more, but still he's a good fighter. I learn from him too. Yeah, yeah. I think Beta has a couple of years more experience of Kyokushin Karate, a couple more years than Mo. So I can see that the way he fights. He's been training since he was a very small boy. I can see that because uh, his basic foundation is very solid and uh, his moves are very solid and he's got more techniques and more style compared to a lot of green belts here. So uh, I can see he's been training for a long time. He's been training longer than I did, I think. And uh, he got skills, you know, he got flexibility and he knows how to time himself but I wish, uh, I wish he can fight a little bit more like Mo I mean, Beta is a very strong guy mentally and physically and mentally he's very strong too but I really want him to uh, I really want him to just go you know pound to pound and you know a little bit more you know, a little bit more of drive next week is a Korea Open Kyokushin Karate tournament and we got two, uh, two weight categories, one's under 70, one's above 70. And both Mo and Peter, they're fighting under 70. And uh, apparently uh, Mo's overweight, Mo's uh, 78, I think. He's got to lose eight kilos in two weeks, which is going to be very tough. I think he's uh, feeding himself chicken breast and water. That's it really, a little bit of salad. So he's, he's going through a hard time. But I really want him to win it. I really want him to win the first place because he got second place last time. And I remember three years ago, he won first place in Abu Dhabi. So I really want him to go for the gold this, this time in Korea. Yeah.